best way to ombre. I've got my opinion, which usually is the only opinion that matters. No. But in this situation, I'm gonna bring in a professional. Thank God! Oh, We're gonna talk to Tracy about what is the best way to ombre? Acrylic, gel, gel paints, gel polish, sideways, vertical, left, center, right. Tracy, are you ready to talk about this? Should we bring in Greg? Best way to ombre? Do I look constipated? Yes, no, yes. <laughs> All right, so is that yes to constipation? I look constipated? Yes, All right. not a no to bringing Greg in. No to bringing Greg, okay, good. Just wanted to get that clear. Best way to ombre, oh, I didn't actually, didn't even talk about airbrushing, which I think you might mention. In your opinion, what is the best way to ombre? What are some of the differences? When might you do one over the other? Blah, 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 blah. Talk to us, Trace. Airbrush. <laughs> <laughs> All the time, every time. I like it, time. man. It's easy, it's fast. And I can get that you would, might want different subtle tones, you know, so it depends. Like, are they gonna continue wearing it? Is, is ombre their thing? Then I probably would do it in acrylic, you know? Um, I think you can get a little bit of a softer look in the ombre with acrylic. ombre with hard gel, total pain in the butt. Um, I wouldn't, I know, no, you can't pay me enough. You have pigment way of doing it, which is, Super Ooh. easy also. With a makeup brush? Yeah, with the makeup brush. It really depends on the look that you're going for. For me, 99% of the time, I pull out an airbrush gun, gel top coat it, and call it a day. You mentioned that like you can get a softer look when doing it with acrylic. Mm -hmm. What do you mean by that? Like more of like a, a natural blend kind of a between the pink and the white? Is that kind of what you're saying? Or what do you mean by that? Milky white. Oh, more milky yeah, white. Yeah, yeah, like that, our core our white. white. Yeah, not that you can't customize your uh, airbrush paints. You can, you can tone them down too. But if a client was gonna continually wear them, I might do it in acrylic because I really think that is a beautiful look. If they're just doing it temporarily, airbrush it, call it a day. Maintenance is key. So it's gonna be easy to take off and easy to do the next thing they want. Okay, got it. So more permanent look, go acrylic. Cause you can get that nice, especially that 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 core white, which is my favorite white. I love that milky, you know, white. But what about for like holidays? You know, glitter ombres. I mean, there's so many different ways to 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 do it. Is that is that right? Wrong? What? Wrong? Is that right? That's right. Okay, good. I thought it was right. Yeah, glitter press. If you're doing a, 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 a glitter ombre, just glitter press the top. It's it's, a, it's on the surface again for maintenance. Then if you're doing colors, let's say you want like a yellow to a red with an orange in the middle, gel polish ombre is super, super easy. You can just blend it in the center to get that. So it depends if you're going, you know, strictly classic ombre pink and white, or are you doing color? Again, it's, it's not a one answer. I've also seen the double dip with gel paint paint ombre where you take the brush and then dip one side and dip the other side and then stroke down the middle of the nail so you get that vertical sort of ombre. That one's kind of nice. What do you think about that one? For vertical ombres, gel paint and doing it that way is one of the easiest ways of doing it. Sometimes I won't double dip. I like to just pick up one color and paint halfway through it and then pick up the, the other color on the other side of the brush and paint halfway and meet in the middle. Ah. Um, all preference. Uh, but if you're doing verticals, that is actually the easiest way of accomplishing them. I invented that way of doing ombres, just want to say. I've invented, I invented ombres. I invented the word ombres. Good for you, man. Good for you, good for you. I invented everything that you like in life, Tracy. I invented it. <laughs> and last question, just before we, we end this. Um, you have your preference in ombres. Nice. Preference in bosses. Could be for Greg. Young. <laughs> so much for watching our nail videos to check out more head right over here and to subscribe to our channel click right over here